Okay, so today I'm going to be talking about international business and how you can use humor with that. Um, humor is a universal human characteristic. Everybody laughs. It's just different from culture to culture. Okay, so today we're going to be briefly talking about <coughs> humor in the U.S., humor in uh, England, in Germany, and in Asian cultures. Okay, so in the U.S., Presentations are often started with like funny cartoons, like Steve Jobs, for example. I don't know if you've ever seen his uh, presentations, but he always opens up with uh, some skit that he pays for. Very, very expensive skit. Um, Americans have a very particular kind of humor. They have a, they use sarcasm a lot in their humor, and a lot of cultures don't understand sarcasm. So, especially Asians. Um, So Asian culture, when it comes to humor, um, few Asians are amused with humor in the business setting, but apparently Koreans can appreciate everyone's jokes, they'll laugh at anything. I found that interesting, but I don't know if it's true or not. Um, Asians also find little merit in jokes about sex and religion and minorities, but they tend to laugh out of politeness in a business setting when a joke is told internationally. And uh, they usually just take jokes literally, so that's why they don't get the U.S. sarcasm. So it can be sort of awkward if you were in a business situation and you were presenting a joke using sarcasm. So the British, they like to have fun. So <laughs> in their uh, business meetings, they also like to use cartoons and stuff. Um, their, jo their jokes are also uh, self-depreciating, which means that they make fun of themselves, so they do that a lot. And uh, they like to uh, use humor in the workplace to ease uh, tensions between their customers. So Germans, very uh, strict people. <laughs> they find humor out of place in business situations. They don't appreciate jokes during business negotiations, which I find hard to believe. Um, there actually was a study done where an American went to a German, uh, over to Germany in a German corporation and he had a cartoon presentation at the very beginning. They didn't laugh, it was super awkward. They actually just made fun of him, so I wouldn't do that if I were you. Um, they tend to do other socializing after work when they go get drunk at the pub. So. That. Um, so, is there such thing as international humor? After all that, there actually is. Um, people use nuances, which is like the American sarcasm, and also Australia, for their jokes, they use uh, provocative comments when they joke, so that's just something they do, and they tend to use that internationally as well. Also, people like to use neighboring countries as a center of the joke, so the British always have jokes against the Irish, and the Irish always have jokes against the British. Same with America and Canada. I'm sure you've heard all those jokes. Um, some business people, though, say not to use humor at all during a business presentation, which I think is not a good choice because humor tends to relax your, the, the other cultures and the other people in the office. So. I would definitely do that. Um, but remember, there's always a risk to offending someone, so just be very cautious when telling jokes. And just remember, we all laugh, but we all don't laugh at the same things. Thank you for your time. I'm Lee